The new year is here, and with it comes the 12th humble original game, Kimmy, from Star Made Games. Kimmy is a visual novel set in the 60s about a girl named Dana, who meets a younger friend named Kimmy. The story follows Dana as she spends her summer babysitting Kimmy and teaching her how to make friends. After playing through the two-hour game, I get the impression that the characters and events are all based off of real experiences that the author had as a child. The story feels very personable, yet relatable, as I found myself identifying characters I was meeting in the game with kids from my childhood, which is a credit to the game's writing. Unfortunately, the realism of the story ultimately means the plot is rather dull and uninteresting. The opening sequence of the game presents a lot of questions about the character Kimmy, and implies certain fantastical elements. However, by the end of the game, all of these questions are answered with fairly obvious, realistic, and rather uninteresting consequences. That being said, the ending of the game was actually quite emotional and affecting, thanks mainly to the game's great soundtrack. Soft acoustic guitar progressions play throughout the entire game and reflect the mood of the story. When you're out meeting new characters around town, the music has a lazy summer vacation vibe. Yet when the story explores some of its darker elements, the acoustic melodies become somber and quiet. The soundtrack not only works well to emphasise the emotion of a scene, it's also very pleasant to listen to. Visually, the game is created using a very rough hand-drawn aesthetic that is designed to reflect the youth of the characters and the point of view of the narrator telling the story of her childhood. There's very little animation, instead the game is made up of a number of scenes stitched together that are meant to look like they're drawn with crayon. I like the look and I think it matches the framing of the narrative quite well. If you haven't played a visual novel before, it's important to know that there is very little actual gameplay involved and very little impact you can have on the story's progression. This is particularly so for Kimmy. You can choose who you talk to and in what order, but most of your time will be spent reading through text boxes, learning about characters and explaining the rules to playground games like Hopscotch and Horseshoes. If you want to see everything each character has to say, you'll need to replay the game, but in my opinion there's only a handful of interesting characters that are worth speaking to every day. Kimmy is an interesting addition to the Humble Original program, as it tells a very real and personal story that deals with a number of relatable and heavy issues that aren't really explored in traditional games. I found this realistic story to be somewhat uninteresting by the end, but quite enjoyed the game for its great soundtrack and the way it delivered its narrative. A good start for Humble Originals in 2017.